Many times I play, everybody asks me, how do I generate so many power on my serve? So today I'm going to show you a little bit as to um, just my, my, uh, my motion and how what I do to generate a lot of power from my serve. All right, so listen, so the first thing I do is most of my power comes from my legs. So you first thing you see me what I do when I go, I would go down first. So the good drill to do, the first thing I, I would encourage you all to do is to do that drill. All right, that drill, all right? So I do this, my drill, first drill I do is this, all right? So all you can do, you can do this if you want, but I don't have a back, big back swing. So most people do this and big back swing, I, all I do is this, all right? So I, I do this, the first one, and I do this after. Do this, and then I do this, all right? So that's the first drill I do. Um, so you see my hands in front of me, stand close stance, always close stance, and I will go down, I will go down. And then I would split up, split up, all right? And then I would do a small short serve, up, up, all right? So work on that first, work on that first, up, up, work on that first, all right? Work on that first. And then when you want to put a little more power into it, try to Hold your hand back a little longer and try to rotate your body. All right? Go here, rotate your body, and hit. Hold it back, rotate your body, then hit. All right? So what that what that doing is, what that doing is, you clean you clean your path for your part of the swing. So first thing we were, we were doing is was work on work on this one first. You work on this first. All right? Next one you. Hold, hold it, open your body, and then swing. So once you open your body, you can swing as hard as you want. So put a little more power, o open, hit. Down, open, fire your hands. Down, open, fire your hands, all right? So once you get that, you put it together. Now make it look all a smooth transition. Right? And feel like when you hit the ball, right? Feel like you're moving on that toe. Put your weight on, on, your, put your, weight on your back foot. And when you transition, feel like you're going on your toes. On my toes, right? So the ball can go forward. All right, let me hit a couple more. All right, so watch it again. So the drill is one, two, three, open, hit. One, two, three, open, hit. All right? One thing now is. Uh, so. Try avoid having a really small stance or last stance. Last stance, you can't get back in here. So, short stance, you really can't do no power because you are balanced. You want to go a little bit more than shoulder width apart, right? Go down, always go down, key. Use your legs, go down. And on the contact, you hit it up, going up. So I hit it, going up. So you get down, and when you get here, you turn your body, and you hit the ball on the upward motion, right? Upward motion to get ready. But av avoid, the biggest error I see people do is this. They do this, and they come up with the whole head. Keep your head, keep your head low. Do not raise, do not raise your head. Keep your head low through the swing. Keep your head through the swing. All right, one more. 
drill. So be careful. And you see what I'm doing, right? You see I'm not going into the, into the, into the, um, right? I'm not doing that. So I keep all my body weight right here, centered. I'm not, because I'm rotating. I'm not sliding. I will rotate through the ball. Say, rotate my body. So you rotate, right? Rotate. You see, I'm still here. All my weight now is on my left foot. Straight. See how this is straight? So what I do is, you'll see me start here. I'll go down. And when I come up, this, all I do is get on my toes and I want to straighten my leg. I rotate. I'm not going to slide forward and lean over. So you rotate, open your legs and hit. 